In this course, I will teach you how to create a professional and beautiful e-learning website from scratch using WordPress. Basically, you're going to be building and developing both a WordPress LMS theme and an LMS plugin. If you haven't heard about LMS before, it's the shortcut for learning management system. This type of LMS themes and plugins is trending right now. It allows you to build and launch your own school and start teaching students online all over the world. So based on a study made by Forbes, the e-learning market is expected to reach 350 billions by 2025. So that's a billion dollar industry. Also, there is a huge demand for this type of plugins in the marketplace. WordPress developers are making tons of sales, selling LMS themes and plugins in platforms like Code Canyon and ThemeForest. So the skills that you're going to be learning in this course are highly valuable. Now for the design features and functionalities of the WordPress theme that you're going to be building. First of all, this is the home page. We'll be designing it from scratch using HTML and CSS. On top of this page, you will see the top header where you can have on the left side your logo. Obviously, you can change it and place your own. Next, on the right, you will have your beautiful and useful main menu. This menu can be changed dynamically from the WordPress dashboard. Down below, we'll have the first section where we're gonna have a video playing in the background with this text in input field to allow students to search for topics and a button on the bottom side with this glowing animation. Next, we'll design our courses categories with this nice pop-up animation. In the third section, we'll be listing our courses. We will be creating this nice dark gradient effect and inside our courses cards, we'll have first the thumbnail, course title, the number of students enrolled, the name of the instructor and other details like the course duration and the number of lecturers and also the difficulty level of the course. And on the bottom side, we'll have the link that will take us directly to the course page. Down below, we're gonna have this nice fixed image effect with these animated numbers. And finally, we're gonna have the footer of our homepage. So when you click on one of these courses, you will be directed to the course page. So this is where our LMS plugin that we're going to be developing will come to play. First, it allows us to create courses in the WordPress dashboard using our custom post site. We can set the course title, add an overview, set the pricing, add the subtitle, the video trailer. You can also add the curriculum and create different type of lectures like audio lectures, video lectures, podcasts, etc. And everything will be displayed dynamically on the front end of our course page, where on the top we'll be loading our header from our theme, down we'll see the course title, and here we'll have the reviews, the number of students enrolled, the course duration, and the video trailer. On the right side, we're gonna have this white panel that has the course pricing and this get started button that's gonna take us directly to the course contents. Down here, we're gonna have the overview of the course with its curriculum displayed dynamically. And finally, we're gonna have another section that shows more courses and our footer at the bottom side. Now let's discuss the content of this course and what you will be learning. So I've divided this course into five sections. In the first section, we will be setting our local host and we'll start developing our LMS plugin. We'll learn the requirements for building a recognizable plugin by WordPress. Next, we will learn to create custom post types and how can we add custom fields without relying on any external plugins. In section number two, we'll be working on the database. We will learn how to connect with WordPress database, how to install the phpMyAdmin in your local host, how to create tables automatically once your plugin is activated, how to save, update, and retrieve data from the database and display it on the front end. So basically to give you an idea on how this plugin works, let me give you an example. The moment you activate your plugin, a new table in the database will be created. So here in the WordPress dashboard, you will have the option to create new courses, when you click on add new, you can add the title, you can add here the overview of the course and down here you can add further details like the subtitle, the course price, the video trailer and the curriculum. So basically once you hit save or update, all these informations will be saved in the database and a new course page will be created automatically. And inside this course page, we will retrieve all the data saved related to this specific course. All right, so in section number three of this course, we'll be designing our WordPress plugin using HTML and CSS. You will learn how to set up the HTML structure of your course page. You will learn how to embed videos in your HTML code, how to change fonts, how to add icons, how to load images dynamically from your plugin directory and display them on the front end. And for the sake of having a good performance, we won't gonna rely on any external CSS libraries. Instead, we're going to be building our own. It's gonna be super light and it will make the design of our course pages super easy and CEO friendly. So I highly recommend that you take in this course, you can learn everything you need to build premium LMS 
themes and plugins in WordPress. And after learning WordPress development and building your own LMS plugin, you can launch your own online school and start making income teaching online. You can customize this plugin, add more functionalities, and sell it on platforms like Code Canyon and ThemeForest. So this course is gonna be an excellent start to you if you want to become an advanced WordPress developer. So if you are interested, join me and let's get started.